pass to the interstellar net is a rather straightforward one. Yes. Yeah. <clears throat> well, the Homo sapien data web is considerably um, created and administered at one level by the many individuals <clears throat> and at another level it's exploited hosted and well a bunch of money is sucked off the top and then sold ridiculously in shares to make it a hollow collapsible pyramid and well I don't know how did that go in at the, the, the crack of the millennium <clears throat> overinflated stock values on the internet well the internet bubble yeah that's what they called it Now you've gone worse though because somehow or another the, you've got the globalist parasites grasping away and the displaced Hollywood types grasping away. They think they have a birthright to our data archive, our data exchange. Mm -mm. you got as much right as anyone else. The right to put in and disseminate information and hopefully be able to access an equal or greater return of other data that you need but do not know so the path is quite simple we have to police it better I've already outlined before put the link there eventually the uh, Interstellar Net Police Copyright Division. You know the kind of shit where we gotta nip, we gotta nip the crime syndicate in the, take their money away, <clears throat> because they were being used to host these Hollywood features, and then later they can sue everything, and Hollywood can own all the shares, the inflated shares of. The Googleplex, which is our YouTube now too, because it's been annexed. Right there. Yes, Bear hasn't been pieced off. Bear wants to be pieced off. We'll put this thing back up for sale starting at six million dollars. Um, once we hit our thousand video, like I said, that's why I come back to push that and a few things off. So, big bag of gold plated. Gaddafi's, sorry Bert, <clears throat> tungsten center gold plated Gaddafi coins, still of, you know, somewhat value, even if, you know, if you peeled the gold off, what would you have, you know, 100 bucks of gold, uh, a few grams, hey Cindy, no, hey, stay here, we're not, we're not going yet. So I'm thinking, why not offer those out as, as a bounty on um, <clears throat> successfully bringing down and convicting all these two-bit internet scammers all over the world. And, uh, you know, make it worth everyone's time to, uh, we'll, we'll, we'll set out the tools to be able to identify and track legally their, you know, their location and map out their infrastructure and then we'll close them down. Get them to the fuck off and we'll, we'll end this bullshit where Hollywood's trying to set up and trap greedy YouTube insiders that are scamming shares and screwing with monopolizing bucks and whatnot. And setting up these big name Hollywood and then, you know, total copyright infringement and then monetizing them. You know, a couple million views. Even if they're not getting a couple million views, just, you know, a couple hundred or a couple thousand, that's where they're dumping all the views that they 
they scam off of those they want to scrutinize. Yeah. D network. So, uh, hey. There's a lot of you bored trolls out there. We can have you turning in on one another. Equip you with some legal tools and techniques, and um, you can you can go hunt all over the world. Uh, you know you're totally accountable for what you do. Everyone is, and anything done on the net stays on the net forever, as long as there is a net or anything in storage that was once of the net. So uh, put it down there. What do you think? <clears throat> like I say, our um, plasma conduit window of opportunity for a, a uh, gratuitous exchange on the data net is closed now for a while, but it'll 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 be back. And in the meantime, we can practice the stellar net. Yes, that's right. But should become more familiar with that the presentation in the sky cast in the sky near or above you. Ready. Peace out.